a teacher is creating an assignment worth 70 points. So the total number of points is 70. So I'm just going to label this total. The assignment will consist of questions worth one point. So that's one variable here. And the question and questions worth three points. So this is our second variable. So I'm just going to label this one and two here. Which equation represents the situation where x represents the number of one point questions? So x is equal to one point and y represents the number of three point questions. So I have two variables here, right? So basically, I know that the total assignment is worth 70 points, right? So I know that this has to equal 70 points. Now, if it's one point, it's we can just leave it as x. Now, if we want to find y, think about it. y is basically three points. And y represents the number of three point questions. Okay, so we're going to add y. However, it's not just going to be x plus y equals 70 points, right? It's going to be 3y because it's three points. Okay, so say if there was like 10 three-point questions, this value would be equal to 30, right? Because each question is three points. So that's why it's 3y. So the correct answer choice here is D.